Hey guys, what's up? Pastor Matt here. Thanks for checking into the YouTube channel. Hey, if you're new or visiting a Gospel Fellowship, that's my church. We're a Bible-believing Reformed church just north of Pittsburgh. We'd love to have you come check us out some point in real life. Come worship with us, Gospel Fellowship PCA. All right, well, today this is going to be another one of those uh, videos where I just give away free stuff. I like doing videos like that. Um, anytime I write something or produce something or concoct some plan, <laughs> Usually, usually related to the Bible or prayer or study or something like that. I like to try to give it away and put it into the hands of as many people as possible. And yes, this is another one of these free giveaway episodes. Um, I have a couple others like this. You're going to want to search back through my YouTube channel. In fact, what I'll do is I'll put those videos up as those little, you know, the videos that pop up at the end of the video suggesting other things. I'll put a couple of those up for you so you can find other good things. But I have two things to give away for free today. Wish I could give you the world because I love you, especially those of you who subscribe to this channel. I'm so thankful that you follow me here and on Twitter and Facebook and all that kind of stuff. And I'm so glad there are people out there that are kindred spirits with me and love what I love and uh, share what I share and believe what I believe and preach what I preach. So you come to this YouTube channel, um, not because you're bored, but because you like the kind of stuff that I'm into. So anyway, thanks for that. So let me share with you two things that I can give you for free today. And I hope that you will appreciate these. I do have my screen sharing function up here. Um, this is my YouTube channel, of course, duh, you're already here watching. But let me take you over to a website called the jesociety.org. This stands for the Jonathan Edwards Society. And it's a group of Edward scholars that work together and collaborate on writing projects under the direction of the president of the society and the proprietor of jesociety.org. His name is Dr. Rob Boss. He's another Edward scholar. And he's been publishing books on and related to Jonathan Edwards for some time now. And as a matter of fact, they're just releasing a new book this week called The Miscellaneous Companion Volume 2. So here's a look at the miscellaneous companions, the fact that it's named volume two suggests, as you could probably already figure out, that there is already a volume one. I have it over there on my shelf. It's a fantastic book. I have a chapter in that book, as do several of my friends, including John Marco, my best of all friends, had uh, him as my friend since we were even before kindergarten. Anyways, I digress. So the second volume has just recently come out, and uh, it got some fantastic reviews. Now, let me read you the description of this. It says the Jonathan Edwards Miscellaneous Companion Volume 2 is a product of JE Society Miscellaneous Project. Essays were contributed by an international body of scholars hailing from East Asia, Australia, the UK, North America. The contributions canvas a wide range of topics contained in Jonathan Edwards' Miscellaneous, including death, the resurrection, happiness, hell, incarnation, apologetics, war, typology, providence, holiness, etc., etc., and so volume two just recently came out and you can buy this on Amazon, buy this on Amazon with the link that I'll provide in the description of this video. But I told you that this was a video in which I give things away for free. So what gives? Well, I talked to Dr. Rob Boss, um, the director of JE Society and the editor of the, these volumes. And I told him, look, I, I really am pleased to contribute, but I, I prefer to give away things for free as much as possible whenever I write something. And so I asked him for permission to give away my chapter, and he gladly said yes and thought it was a fantastic idea. So I am announcing today that I will give you my free chapter. Now, here's what it's going to look like. It's, it's, uh, it's going to be awesome. Um, what's neat about the Jonathan Edwards Miscellaneous Companions is that Dr. Boss is also a computer visualization guru, and I don't fully understand exactly how all this works, but when you're searching through Edwards' uh, writings, Edwards has a vast amount of volumes of, of writings and extant materials, treatises, and all kinds of public and private writings. Edwards is just, you know, huge, but Dr. Boss put away, put together a way based on computer simulation is that a word? Simu simulate, simulization? <laughs> to make connections in Edwards' thoughts on various topics. And so uh, what's neat about this book is it's actually filled with uh, those little QR code things where you can scan a particular chapter and it'll take you to the computer visualizations simulations. Simula simulations. Uh, anyways, 
here is my chapter. My chapter is called Edwards' Theological Project in the Pursuit of Holiness in the Early Years, Miscellaneous Numbers A, 66 and 141. And uh, we're going to send you this chapter totally free just as a sample of what this volume is like. So anyway, this volume is really cool. And um, let me just get to, as I'm scrolling through here, there's tables and graphics. Aha, here's a, here's a graphic of a visualization of holiness, light, righteousness, and reflection and communication. And what it has here is this cool QR code. This will be right in the book. And so you can scan this with your phone and it'll take you right to the, um, this incredible computer program that analyzes Edwards' works in a very visual way. So in the miscellaneous volume two, the companions, you have not only these chapters by world-class scholars, uh, present company excluded, I'm just a regular old guy, um, but you have all this neat access to the, the computer stuff. So anyway, we're gonna send you this chapter for free as a kind of a, you know, a little taste tester, a little sample, a little sampling platter so to speak, before you decide if you want to get the whole volume or how much time you want to spend looking through Edwards' miscellaneous in the next few months. So that's totally free. What I'm asking you to do, if you'd like to get this, is send me an email, okay? Email me, and I'll reply with this as a PDF. That's the deal. So uh, where's my email address? Well, it's kind of in code on my about page. I don't just put it on my about page because I'm afraid some computer is going to pick it up and spam me like crazy. But anybody with half a brain can read my about page on my YouTube channel and figure out my email address pretty easily. So I trust you, dear viewer, that you can very easily head over to my YouTube channel and click on my about page. Let's just do that for fun here. Here's my YouTube channel. Here's the about page. And if you read through this, you'll be able to, by putting together the clues, my email address, no problem. All right, so that's the first thing we're gonna give you is this free chapter of Miscellaneous Companion Volume Two, my personal contribution on Edwards and holiness, which he wrote when he was uh, a young person. All right, now the second thing I'm giving away for free right now is this Jonathan Edwards reading guide for 2022. Now, one of the main questions that people ask me all the time is, where do I start reading Jonathan Edwards? And that's a very good question. Uh, a question that we should think about, because if I were to have started with freedom of the will, I don't know that I would be an Edwards scholar today. I might <laughs> get, I've gotten pretty frustrated and quit. Uh, so what I did is I put together this handy dandy reading guide right here, and I'm going to go ahead and post this on my about page. So if you click on my about page right here, you can simply scroll down and see a bunch of stuff that I give away for free. And here it is right here, the Jonathan Edwards reading plan. You can go ahead and get this. Um, and what you do with this is you simply check it off as you read through the pages of Edwards. Now, a lot of you guys are Bible readers too, and uh, you've probably done a Bible reading plan. You might have even done my Bible reading plan. In fact, I have one that's already for free on my YouTube channel. If you go over here and click on Bible reading plan, then this will pop up. And you read the Bible and check it off. And what's nice about my plan is that there's no time uh, correspondent to it. So you just read the Bible in whatever pace you want to. A lot of the Bible reading plans, you know, you're supposed to read so many pages a day or so many chapters a day. And then you get frustrated because it's February and you're already behind and then you quit. But my plan, you just read them and check them off as you go. You can do it in four years or two years or two months or two weeks or whatever you want to do. Anyway, I've made something similar like that for reading Jonathan Edwards. So you're going to start off, and what I want you to notice here is that you're going to go from easiest to longer. I don't actually have his hardest works in this plan, but I do have several of his important works. So we're going to start off with his resolutions, which is only six pages. And uh, my book is coming out on the resolutions. If it ever does come out, it's supposed to come out any time. It's still not out. But you can read the resolutions and it's only six pages. So you can just read it and check it off. And notice I have these in groups of five pages because some of you don't read one page at a time. You might read five pages at a time. So you can do it that way. And notice here that um, each one of these works is going to be a little bit longer than the last. So you can just start in January reading the resolutions and just kind of work your way up as much as you want to do. Again, no time frame and no harm, no foul. If you want to bail out at any point, doesn't matter to me. But you'll read the resolutions and then his personal narrative, which he wrote in 1740. And then you'll read Sinners in the Hands of an Angry God, because every Edward scholar needs to read that. A Sermon, the Preciousness of Time, 
and so on and so forth. And notice that these entries keep getting longer and longer as you pour yourself into Edwards until finally we get all the way down to reading one of his major works, The Religious Affections. Now, you'll notice here in this document that I've already done all of the homework for you by hyperlinking to uh, edwards.yale.edu so you can get all this stuff for free on your computer. You don't even have to buy a book. So that's fantastic, right? So let's go to this and uh, we'll click on this hyperlink and look, there it is right there, the resolutions. So that's super duper easy. Now, what I like to do, and you can do this as well. I don't like to sit here and read on my desktop. I find that to be really straining to the eyes. So you can do something like this. This is super simple. I just make a copy and paste of the article that I'm reading from Jonathan Edwards. So let's go ahead and just copy and paste this. It's only six pages long. And I'll hit control copy. And then I'll go over to a Word or Google Doc, Word document or a Google Doc. And I will just simply plop that down. And I can print it up if I want to. Or if I'm really fancy, I can even email that to my own Kindle or to my e-reader or whatever other device I have. So uh, let's just go ahead and do that. I'll just control copy that. And then um, let's see here, uh, I got myself in trouble. I'm gonna need to open up uh, a Word document or Google Docs. Bada boom, bada bang. And there it is. Now I can print this out, do whatever else I want to do with it. If I want to send this to my Kindle, I can do that. And that's how you read Jonathan Edwards. You can read everything, everything totally for free. You don't even need to buy even one book. So there you go. And again, if you go to uh, the Edwards site, which is edwards.yale.edu, right here like this, then you can read through all of Jonathan Edwards' books. So again, let's just go back to the reading plan right here. And again, you can hyperlink and just hop right over there. But let's say uh, I wanted to read, I don't know, miscellanies A through 50. Then I could, the other way I could do it is I could go over to edwards.yale.edu and I could just go to the volume on the miscellanies like such and begin reading them with all of their scholarly introductions and whatnots and wherefores and pretty easy stuff. All right, so don't ever say I never gave you anything. Try to give away everything I do for you. I'd give you everything if I could, honestly. I'd even give you my resolutions book if it ever comes out, but we'll see if it ever does. Supposedly it's coming out, I don't know, next week or something like that. Anyways, uh, hey, thanks for checking into this YouTube video. You know, I do love you guys lots, and I will talk to you later.